Top 10 Facts About the Universe Space. We know so little about it. So much of our knowledge is confined to our one little planet which is suspended in a universe that goes for billions of light years in each direction. Every day, researchers and scientists are learning new things about how space works. Laws of physics are constantly being challenged in the far reaches of the universe, where black holes and supernovas exist. In short, space is an incredibly wondrous place. Welcome to Facts Hut, and today we will be counting down our top 10 amazing facts about the universe. If you are new to the channel, then welcome. We would love for you to subscribe to our channel. Also, as we are continuously coming out with new videos, be sure to hit the notification bell to stay informed of our latest releases. With that being said, let's take a look at the universe. Number 10. Space is completely silent. Not many people think about what space sounds like, but in actuality, it doesn't take much thought. That's because there is no sound in space. Sound waves need a medium to reverberate off of, something that can carry it and project it. Here on Earth, we have air. The waves ride along the particles in the air, along water, and off of solid surfaces. In space, though, there is no atmosphere. There are no particles of oxygen or water or anything else which sound waves can use to move from one place to another. The only way astronauts can verbally communicate is by using radios, since radio waves can still be sent and received through space. Number 9. Nobody knows how many stars there are in space. Have you ever looked up into the night sky and taken a look at how many stars there are? It is astounding. Scientists and astronomers predict that there are around 200 to 400 billion stars in the Milky Way, which is what we are able to see. Here's the thing. The Milky Way is just one of billions of galaxies in our universe. What is even more mind-boggling is the fact that these galaxies vary in size, with some of them being many times bigger than our own galaxy. Each of them have billions and billions of stars of their own, just like we do. So, just by the math alone, you would have to multiply 400 billion by another 400 to 800 billion, and that's with no variables thrown in. Just by itself, that's a lot of zeros in the number. Number 8. There is a planet-sized diamond floating in the universe. We have all heard of black holes, comets, and huge gas clouds that exist in the universe. What about diamonds? You heard right, diamonds. Astronomers have discovered the largest known diamond in our galaxy. It's a massive lump of crystallized diamond known as BPM 37093, otherwise known as Lucy after the legendary Beatles song Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds. This diamond exists about 50 light years away from the constellation of Centaurus, but we aren't talking about a diamond the size of a basketball or a car or even a city. This diamond is the size of a planet. Lucy is about 25,000 miles across, making it even larger than Earth. Also, it weighs in at a massive 10 billion trillion trillion carats. Number 7. Footprints on the Moon will stay there for the next 100 million years. When we go to the beach and take a walk in the sand, we leave our footprints. However, they don't stay around for long. After a little time, they will disappear as wind carries more sand over them, or the water washes it away, or another person comes along. But when Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin walked on the moon, the footprints they left are still there. The moon has no atmosphere, it has no wind to erode the surface, and no water to wash away the footprints. Therefore, footprints, the tire tracks from the rovers, and all of the other marks made by asteroids and space debris will stay there for millions and millions of years. Number 6. The possibility of life in the universe is higher than you may realize. Scientists searching for extraterrestrial life focus on what are called Goldilocks planets, which are planets that fall into a star's habitable zone. Earth is a prime example. Just the right distance from the sun means the temperature is right and that water can exist in all three states. There are other planets thought to have similar features as Earth. In the Milky Way alone, there are an estimated 500 million potential Goldilocks planets. This allows for a much more optimistic view of extraterrestrial life. Of course, extraterrestrial life doesn't have to exist in the form of little green men. It can be something as simple as bacteria or any number of single-cell organisms. What will really blow your mind is when you consider that this is only talking about the Milky Way. What about the hundreds of billions of other galaxies? Interesting thought, right? 
Number 5. There is water floating in space. We have already talked about a planet-sized floating diamond in outer space. What else could there be? How about a huge mass of floating water? Astronomers have found a massive water vapor cloud which is about 10 billion light years away. How it got there is a mystery. But it isn't the distance from Earth or even the fact that it exists that will blow your mind. It's the size. This floating mass of water vapor holds 140 trillion times the volume of water of all of the Earth's oceans. You heard that right. We said trillion with a T. It is not only the farthest discovery of water ever found, it is the largest. Number 4. Pluto is smaller than the United States It's okay to admit it, many of us feel sorry for Pluto. It held the title of our solar system's smallest planet for a number of years. Then it lost its classification as a planet. What a sad day. There were a number of reasons why, but the main one was that Pluto is too small to be considered a planet. How small are we actually talking? Believe it or not, if you were to set Pluto on Earth, it would be smaller than the continental United States. If you were to walk around the equator of Pluto, it would be the same distance as walking from London to Denver, Colorado. It is hard to consider something a planet when it is that small. Sorry Pluto, you're still loved. Number 3. When you look into the night sky, you are looking back in time. The light year is the biggest unit of measurement for distance that we have in the universe. It is the distance that light can travel over the span of one year. But as light is not instantaneous and takes time to travel, we do not always see the most recent image of things when we look up. The stars are anywhere from dozens to millions of light years away. What that means is that when we look at a star, we are seeing it as it exists today. Take Proxima Centauri as an example. At 4.243 light years from Earth, it is the closest star to our solar system. Because light takes that long to reach us, we are seeing the star as it existed 4.23 years ago. In reality, that star could have exploded and we would not know it until 4.243 years after it happened. This same principle exists for other stars. You could be seeing a star as it existed during the time of the dinosaurs. Number 2. The Voyager 1 spacecraft is the most distant man-made object from Earth. In 1977, NASA's Voyager program launched two spacecraft, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2. The probes were meant to explore the planets and moons of the outer solar system over the span of a few decades. Over the years, they accomplished their missions, giving us critical information about the planets and even send back photographs. Now, both are traveling through the heliosphere at the edge of our solar system and continuing to go into interstellar space. On March 20, 2013, Voyager 1 became the first man-made object to leave the solar system and is now the furthest man-made object from Earth. It is long past Pluto and is voyaging further and further away until its power supply runs out. Number 1. There could be an infinite number of universes. It is more theory than fact, but many branches of science, math, mechanics, and astrophysics have all come to the same conclusions. Our universe is just one of many, and we may actually exist in something called a multiverse. There are different ideas of how this can actually be. Many theories propose bubble or parallel universes that hover in different dimensions just out of reach of our own. In layman's terms, it is similar to the idea of, if you can imagine it, there is a universe where it exists. It may seem like a far-fetched concept or science fiction run amok, but these theories are actually proving to be some of the most reasonable solutions to problems that are being thrown up by our discoveries of how the universe works. Do you agree with our list? What are some facts about our universe that you find particularly amazing? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to give the video a like and to check out some of our previous videos for more great content. We'll see you next time.